Hello, it's Gareth Wright from GAW Football and let's discuss the 10 talking points from the weekend's Premier League football action. Number 1. Adam Wharton's midfield brilliance. Adam Wharton's calmness in midfield stood out during Crystal Palace's match at Anfield. His impressive pass completion of 88% helped them thwart Liverpool's attack and showcase potential as one of the Premier League's brightest talents. Number two, Arsenal's familiar frustrations. Arsenal's inability to hold the lead against Villa echoes similar situation a year ago against Liverpool. Defensive lapses and lack of ruthlessness in attack continue to haunt Mikel Arteta's side, raising questions about their ability to compete at the top of the league. Number three, persistent problems in the Premier League. Despite the excitement of a potential three-way race towards the end of the season, both Liverpool and Arsenal's setbacks highlighted the ongoing issues in the league. While the competitive nature has increased, the concern whether City's disparity in financial power will make it a one-team league going forward. Number four, Kovacic's impact for City. Matteo Kovacic's stellar performance for Man City showed the team's strength and depth in midfield. His crucial goal against Luton demonstrated his ability to step up when needed and reassured Pep Guardiola that he could use his strength and depth and rest players like Rodri. Number 5. Eric Ten Hag's frustration at Man United Man United's disappointing display left Eric Ten Hag frustrated. With the Champions League qualification all but ended, Questions arise whether the team's trajectory under his stewardship will continue at the end of the season. Number six, Pereira shines for Fulham. Andros Pereira's standout performance against West Ham highlighted Fulham's potential to be a top half team. Pereira's brace showcased his talent and bolstered Fulham's aspirations to finish in the top half. Number seven, Newcastle's dominance over Tottenham. Newcastle's convincing win over Tottenham exposed. James Madison's struggles highlighted Eddie Howe's impact as a manager and the effect of Isaac up front underscored Newcastle's potential under Howe. Number eight, Danilo's influence for Nottingham Forest. Danilo's exceptional performance for Nottingham Forest against Wolves showcased his potential importance for the team's success. His midfield prowess and tactical awareness proved vital in securing the crucial result for Forest. Number 9. Burnley's resilience despite relegation threat. Despite facing relegation, Burnley's recent performance offer hope for the future. Improved defensive solidity and promising displays signal a potential resurgence in the championship. Number 10, our blaster's f- bright future for Sheffield United. Despite Sheffield United's struggles, young midfielder Oliver Blaster impressed against Brentford. Chris Wilder praised Blaster's performance reflected optimism for the club's rebuild process in the championship. Overall, the weekend's football action provided plenty of talking points from standout performances to ongoing challenges facing plenty of Premier League clubs from relegation to title challenging. Thank you once again for tuning in. If you'd like to share, like and subscribe and leave comments below about your thoughts on the weekend action. Thank you. Goodbye.